For me, a school of architecture is only as good as the students and the staff who have always been amazing. That's what's kept me here. But then on top of that, we have this new building and we've actually noticed that the work rate of the students has gone up. The vibrancy of the students has gone up. If you're ever feeling a bit down, come into Abercrombie Block and uh, by spending a half an hour to an hour in the building, it's particularly on School of Architecture, I would say that, is that you'll get a shot in the arm and you'll be ready to start your day. From the point of view of an architecture student, to see it from the very foundations and to be in the building before it even existed, to watching it boom, built up, and learning just exactly what the construction techniques were used and then actually using the final product in a kind of very valuable lesson. I think the features that are most important for students are uh, flexible learning spaces. So we have a lot of computers in the building, but we also provide the space to learn as groups or as individuals. You can bring in your laptop and you can you know, adapt the spaces um, to the needs or to your requirements, which is quite good. The increase of space and obviously the massive void in the middle that you see is great because you can sort of like get hold of your friends who are on different levels or on different parts of the studio and it sort of feels a more open and more casual environment to work in. I think in terms of space it's um, benefited us so much there's no longer such a, a fight for computers now that we've got new space for that and also just the facilities are so much better here now. We always had a very good staff and student relationship which architecture schools thrive on but the students now become more collaborative, so they actually spend more time in the building. The building is open 24 hours a day, so it recognises working patterns for students, students that have other commitments during the week, like activities or jobs. Um, but it also means there's a permanent presence in the building, there's a permanent energy in the building, which means also that uh, we just have this automatic buzz, the place just has a buzz to it. We have, we have three phases, and uh, the first phase is the Abercrombie, which is only a taster uh, for what is to come with phases two, which is the John Henry Brooks building, and phase three is the colonnade and uh, the completion of the piazza. So I, for one, cannot wait to see the, um, the completion of the other two phases. I'm really looking forward to it. It feels like you're actually getting your money's worth and the resource and the space. It's more awe-inspiring for sort of students as they come in. And as you come in off the London Road, there's the whole new plaza, there's the competition that uh, some of the architects won of building the pavilion. And it'll just be a much sort of like grand entrance to higher education at Brooks. I think that'd be a really nice entrance as you come in, as you start here at uni.